What's going on people, JJ Simmons, I am back with you one more time, Eternal Life TV. As you can see, by the grace of God, God has graced me to reach everybody. You know, I, I thank God that people are willing to come on the uh, TV show and testify to let y'all know that God is being glorified. Man of God, I met you at uh, Aldine Westfield and Aldine Bender. Yep. You got a CD from me and you called me back probably like a day later or two days and you wanted to get some more. Why did you do that? I wanted to be able to pass it along to a couple of co-workers and other friends of mine that I enjoyed listening to the inspirational words that you actually hear on it. So you could actually listen to rap music and not feel bad about it listening to the CDs. Amen. And you heard the sermon. Yeah, and I heard the sermon. And it's a good, great sermon. Great, uh, great words. Great words of wisdom to pass it along. If you could tell me one thing that stood out on that sermon to you, what would you say it was? Uh, I like how you talked about lingering. Lingering. To become a Christian, you got to linger away from the crowd. <laughs> Boy, I ain't gonna lie to you, that sermon is a classic. I recorded that thing uh, 2010, bro. And uh, that sermon, I get more phone calls, more testimonies out of that sermon, out of all the probably 40 other sermons I have out there, the CDs I didn't put on the street. That That is the number one. And I'm starting to understand because uh, people need to hear truth. Yeah. You know, I was thinking about what you said about the radical, not just being a regular Christian, but a radical one. A radical one is willing to separate. Paul was radical. Yeah. He got saved and never went back to being a Pharisee. He completely followed Christ. Tell the people what it is that you're doing at your church, my bro, about the radical thing. I really like the concept. Tell us about that. Well, it's a radical study, and I uh, can't remember who the author of the book is, but it's a study about being a radical Christian instead of being the normal, modern-day American Christian and just kind of transforming your views and your lifestyle to live that radical Christian life instead of, you know, what we consider over here the American dream. Right, right. You got to be willing to be different. You know, Jesus said this. You know, I was thinking about this a few months ago. Christianity is the only religion that you have to die to self in order to live. Jesus said, he who finds his life will lose it, but he who loses his life for my sake shall find it. You know, that to, in, the, in the natural mind, that sounds backwards, but it's really frontwards because you have to die in order to live. We die to self, but we gain Christ. Christ. Amen? Amen. Praise God. I thank you, Brother Brian. Hey, thank you for that. your support. I'm J.J. Simmons, Eternal Life TV. I'm going to holler at y'all.